The universe found within Frank Herbert's Dune is one that is filled with amazing characters, concepts, and stories. Set in a feudal interstellar society 20,000 years into mankind's future, this series of books contains terminology and names that the author created from multiple sources. Throughout the different adaptations of Dune, however, these names and terms have varied in pronunciation. This has been the source of much debate in the Dune fandom. In this video, I'd like to talk about the pronunciation of one of the names that has garnered the most attention on this channel, that being Harkonnen. We'll start by listening to how the author Frank Herbert himself pronounced this name. This snippet comes from an excerpt that Frank Herbert read from his first book depicting the banquet scene. How typical of a Harkonnen thief, the Duke thought. This is the primary reason why, in my videos, I prefer to use the Harkonnen pronunciation. Another popular pronunciation comes from the 1984 David Lynch film, a project which Frank Herbert praised, was heavily involved with, and supported from start to finish. In Lynch's film, the name of the house in question was pronounced Harkonnen, as we'll now hear. It is I, then Vladimir Harkonnen, who encompasses his doom! <laughs> This is also the way it was pronounced in the Dune 2000 video game. Things aren't going so well for the Harkonnen. It's not surprising that the video game also used this pronunciation, because this title is modeled directly after the Lynch adaptation. Now, if we turn our attention to the 2000 sci-fi miniseries, we can hear that this version reverts to using Frank's pronunciation of the name. And House Harkonnen will be more powerful. This is also the way it is pronounced in the Dune audiobook narrated by Scott Brick. Their mortal enemies, the Harkonnens, had been on Arrakis 80 years. I was interested to see how this name would be pronounced in Denis Villeneuve's adaptation of the novel. From interviews with the actors, it appears that they are also using Frank Herbert's pronunciation of the name. An example comes from Sharon Duncan Brewster, who is playing Liette Kynes, in a segment of Stephen Colbert's interview with the cast before the premiere of the trailer. He connects all the dots. He connects the Harkonnens, he connects House of Atreides, he connects the Fremen. So overall, I think it's fair to say that the evidence supports the use of both pronunciations. However, I don't think that anyone could reasonably say that the way the author said it is wrong. And in fact, his version is used more frequently in adaptations than Lynch's version. A primary motivation for making this video was the sheer volume of comments I've gotten on my videos that try to point out that pronouncing it as Harkonnen is incorrect. I feel that in this matter, there truly is no basis to be dogmatic. There is no real foundation or hard evidence to try and prove whether someone is right or wrong in how they say the names of these fictional characters. Frank Herbert very obviously didn't mind that Lynch chose to pronounce it differently as he was involved throughout the production process of that film. What's interesting to see is how many people consider themselves experts on this matter and believe that Harkonnen is the only way to say this name and that any other is sacrilegious. I have to assume that these individuals have only seen the Lynch version and haven't been bothered to do the research or aren't being honest with themselves if they do know better. Overall, I choose to respect each person's choice and how they prefer to pronounce the names of Frank Herbert's book, and where they choose to place emphasis and inflection. For the longest time, I preferred using Harkonnen when referring to the house, and Harkonnen when it was referring to an individual. That was just my preference though. However, now in the interest of staying consistent, I've transitioned to only using the author's pronunciation. Also, I'm of the opinion that because this is an internationally beloved book, those who come from different backgrounds and speak various languages will be inclined to pronounce these names differently. I see nothing wrong with that. As Frank Herbert wrote as a quote from Lady Jessica, when strangers meet, great allowance should be made for differences of custom and training. What's most important to me beyond the pronunciations of these names is the spirit of the characters and the story and themes of the novel. So I'd encourage any Dune fans out there who feel strongly about the right or wrong way to say these names to consider these facts and to temper their approach. Now I do understand that this is the internet, and this video will most likely have little to no effect on people who routinely attempt to call out other content creators 
or Dune fans who discuss Frank Herbert's book or the different adaptations. But I hope that by sharing this information, I can help to clear up some confusion for supporters of this channel and others who see these comments being made, whether here or in any other corner of the internet where Dune is being discussed. I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a like if you did and be sure to subscribe for more Dune and other sci-fi and fantasy content. And let me know your preference on the pronunciation of this name or others in the Duneverse. Thank you all so much for your support, and as always, have a very nerdy day.